I'm Miranda Valentine, editor of the lifestyle blog Everything Sounds Better in French, and today I'm going to show you how to make a carrot coleslaw. Really easy to do and really, really healthy. I have all of our ingredients laid out here. We're going to start with four cups, which is about 10 ounces, of cleaned, peeled, and grated or shredded, you'll want it like this, nice little bite-sized pieces, um, of carrots. We have two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. We have a fourth of a cup of fresh lemon juice, a half of a teaspoon of kosher salt. That's really important. We want a little bit of more of a crunch. Um, you could also substitute sea salt if you want, but we want a crunchy salt here. Then I have half of a cup of fresh chopped cilantro, half of a cup of nice plump raisins here, gonna be so yummy. Also have two tablespoons of red wine vinegar, and then a quarter of a teaspoon each of paprika, cumin, and cayenne pepper. So I have a bowl here. We're going to start by making our dressing, and I'm using a non-reactive bowl, um, and that's what you'll want to do as well. So that means essentially just not metal. You could either use a plastic bowl for this, or you could use um, a, a glass bowl as I have here. And we're going to start by adding in our lemon juice, our salt, our spices, Look how beautiful that looks when it kind of just dashes in. It's like a little art project. And then our cayenne. Then going to add in the vinegar. And then I'm going to drizzle in and whisk as I drizzle in the olive oil. Because obviously it wants to separate. I'm trying to emulsify and, and make them be friends make them get along. So just whisk, whisk, whisk. Isn't this the prettiest, kind of like reddish, kind of like burnt orange, lovely, lovely color? Okay, wonderful. So just keep going. Okay, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now easy enough, we're just going to add in our carrots. We're gonna save the cilantro and the raisins for the end, so we've not forgotten about them. Let's just give this a nice toss and get the carrots all nice and coated. So I'm using a wooden spoon here and just going to keep tossing until it's nice and coated. You definitely want to make sure that you're using um, a larger bowl like I have so that I have plenty of room to kind of mix everything around, toss it. Um, always give yourself more than enough space to work with. The worst thing would be if I had a bowl that was just big enough for the carrots and then I'm like trying to toss and it's not working. So make it easy on yourself. Always make it easy on yourself. And I love this carrot coleslaw recipe, first of all, because it's a nice change from just the regular old cabbage. And, you know, because we're using vinegar and oil, we don't have kind of all that extra fat. So if you're looking for something really light and healthy, this is definitely a nice alternative. Okay, so let's add in our cilantro now. I'm gonna do half and toss. And I just think that the green and the orange look so beautiful together, and not even like Halloween, although this would be a lovely Halloween dish if you were attending. Halloween party, a little potluck. Carrots disguised as cabbage in a coleslaw. And then let's put in our raisins. Raisins and carrots are so delicious together. One more nice little toss. Toss if you toss, toss, toss. Beautiful. And there you go. It looks beautiful, smells delicious, so easy to make, right? There you go. That's how you make carrot coleslaw. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. And if there's something that you want to learn how to make, send me an email at requests at And don't forget to check out our other great videos.